I got here, I'm so tired. But we still have to go. And where I'm going, man, I have a whole lot of things to do, man. I'm going all the way to. This is my second day in the bus. And I have to go to uh, Paraguay again. And I have to go to Argentina again. Then I'll go to Bolivia. And from there, I'll see if I'll be able to go to uh, Colombia. So I'm trying to see if I'll be able to go to, by the road. And guys, don't forget to subscribe and share. I have a lot of videos, the subsequent videos that I'm bringing it to you. You know, all the way, whatever that is going to happen and whatever that has, has happened previously, I'm going to bring all those videos and the narrating, the story, everything. And you will also get to know what you can do and how or what is going to happen if you are going or the things that you can face or the things that you, it can happen to you so that you have knowledge about that. So guys, thank each and everyone. Thank everyone for subscribing to my channel. The new people who are subscribing, thank you so much, thank you so much, thank you so much. And don't forget to share with your friends also. Comment, and sometimes I want to know where people are watching me from because that is what motivates me so much to go more, to do more, to say more, to travel more. So guys, I'm here traveling again. I was in uh, I was in Chile. The video will be dropping. So guys, don't forget subscribe and share. Guys, I've I've seen a lot of people uh, saying that I don't respond to messages on Instagram. Please, I do respond to messages. Someone will just come to your DM and say hi. And you want me to respond. Someone will come and say, uh, how are you? Someone will say, where are you located? And, man, we have a lot of people who are also in critical situations. And I have to help all those people. Do you understand? I have almost 850 messages. So imagine, you come and you only say hi. And I have to stop everything and just also say hi. Man, if you come, let's make it simple for each and everyone. Whatever your situation, whatever you're going through, whatever you want to ask, just go straight and ask the question, and I will be able to answer that, okay? But when you say, hi, I also say, hi, the next day you come, how are you? The next day you come, I also say, how are you? And by the time you realize, man, we are spending almost three days or one month just by complimenting each other. Meanwhile, the main thing that you need, we haven't even started yet. Do you understand? That if that is what is important to you, please just go ahead and say your problem to me, and I'll be able to. If I'll be able to help you, it's fine. Please let me put this in a close. Those who are going to pass through, uh, uh, do call this country, El Salvador. El Salvador want to. Uh, all Africans to stop traveling or they want Africans to stop transiting from there so now El Salvador has implemented a policy that is a thousand dollars policy their intention is saying that the, the main reason why they are implementing that is to uh, to they are doing this or they are implementing this just to uh, help uh, the airport but that is not so they are just doing that just to uh, blindfold people on that that they, they, they want to uh, renovate the airport they want to do airport to be very nice but that is not, not it's not true they are just implementing this just to avoid foreigners especially from people from India, people from Africa, all African countries and Indian countries to be avoid to be, uh, to be transiting from there. So guys, 
if you know that you are not having thousand dollars or thousand three hundred and fifty dollars to be paid at the airport please don't transit from there even if you're having El Salvador visa they are still going to charge you that kind of money so please if you're not having that don't go there don't transit from there even one hour transit you have to pay that money and it's the money that is not coming back to you they are not going to give you that money back that money will go into their pocket or will go into their system so guys if you know that you are not having that kind of money with you to be paid to El Salvador please don't transfer from there this is a warning that it came into me a lot of people want to go and transfer from there if this is what has happened this is what the president said okay this is what the president said if you don't have that thousand dollars don't transit from there okay so please anyone willing to buy a ticket to go and transit from El Salvador please this is what has come or this is what they have implemented so please avoid it as soon as possible okay I don't want any situation whereby someone will be in a critical situation because uh, they said he has bought a ticket and he's El Salvador and he needs to pay some kind of money. Man, this is ridiculous. They are just avoiding doing uh, this just to avoid Africans, travelers, to be transiting from there. That is all. And we know that. Do you understand? Why is it that they are not uh, avoiding people from Europe? Why is it that they are not charging people from Europe? Why is it that they are not charging people from America? And only for Africans and Indians, because they have seen that these are the kind of people who normally transit from there. These are the people who normally comes in there or normally transit in there to go to the United States. And that's why they are implementing that. And I want you guys, man, if the United States don't want you to go there, man, you can go to Europe. Man, come to Southern America. It's better off. Do you understand? United States is doing everything possible just to avoid people from traveling today. Do you understand? I will say it. I know that people are not going to say it. Other bloggers are not going to say it. Other traveling top bloggers are not going to say it. But I will say it. Do you understand? We have many ways. Man, if you want, uh, you want to travel, just do everything possible. Get Colombia visa or get, uh, uh, I do call it, Brazil visa get Argentina visa, get Paraguay visa. These are the countries, it's easy for you to get visas from them. Do you understand? It's easy. So guys, I'm urging each and everyone just to avoid what? Transiting from uh, El Salvador. Because this is the implementation of $1,000 transit uh, from El Salvador upon you buying uh, doing everything, buying your own ticket, they still want thousand dollars, and even some other uh, some people they will charge you thousand two hundred, thousand three hundred and fifty dollars, and that is ridiculous money. For what? If you want to uh, renovate your airport, if you want to improve your airport, then charge everybody, not only African people. Is it only African people who are going to? Uh, uh, develop your, your country or de de develop your airport? Is it only Africans who travel to, uh, to El Salvador? It's just that, you know, United States is telling them to just avoid people from transiting from there, especially Africans and Indians. So guys, be wise. When you go to travel and talk and I said your transit is going to pass to El Salvador, bear in mind that you are uh, going to pay $1,000 or $1,300. And that money was not going to give you back again. So if you don't have that kind of money to be paid, and you are going there, or you want to pass through there, you're going to be in a hot soup at El Salvador. So please avoid transiting from El Salvador. Now, El Salvador, they started it last month. And I, got, I, I, I was told 
just about three days ago. So please avoid transiting from El Salvador. Thank you guys. And don't forget if the news, if what I'm doing for you, if what I'm, uh, I'm advocating, if what I'm uh, telling you is okay, it's good for you, it's helping you, it's helping some of your friends, please don't forget to share, subscribe, and let me know where you're watching me from. Man, subscribing is free. It's free of charge. You don't pay anything. Okay? You don't pay anything. So just subscribe for me and motivate me and let me do more. Thank you so much, guys. I'll see you in Paraguay. And whatever that I'm going to buy, whatever that is going to happen, I'll let you know. Okay? So see you again in Paraguay, guys. Okay? Adios. Woohoo!